Hi, welcome to the Fusion 360 News Network. I'm Alora Murray. So let's talk about emojis. You're either using them or lying about not using them. Either way, they have become a huge part of most people's daily communicative routine. With emojis being so popular, we thought it would be fun to take a look at the past, present, and future of these small little characters. Let's first talk about the emoji past. They first started to become popular in the 1990s. They were originally created as a form of communication for those with differing languages. In 2011, Apple created the first emoji keyboard for the iPhone. In 2013, the term emoji was added to the Oxford English Dictionary. Now let's take a gander at the present. Both people and brands alike are creating personalized emojis. Even Burger King has its own chicken fries emoji. Also, Domino's recently created an emoji ordering system. Furthermore, a recent study found that 92% of people online use emojis, and 60% of women and 41% of men claim to use emojis frequently. Emoji Tracker reports that the most used emoji on Twitter is the face with tears of joy. In addition, for the first time, racially and culturally diverse emojis are available. Some social media platforms now allow you to hashtag emojis. So what does the future look like for emojis? Well, more links will include these characters. American Sign Language hand signs could appear on emoji keyboards. And Sony Pictures is said to be working on an emoji-based movie. I guess you could say it's safe to say emojis aren't going anywhere anytime soon. That's it for our newscast today. I'm Alora Murray, and this has been a Fusion 360 News Report. Thanks for joining us.